Papa live in the redwood forest. Do you guys know where that is? Yeah. yeah that's, where is that's it? That's real. Yeah, it's our creek. Yeah. 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 <laughs> redwood trees are the tallest trees in the world. Redwoods are also some of the oldest living things on the earth. You remember the big trees we saw today? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah! Tutu and Papa do not have very oh, old redwood oh. trees. They have second growth trees that grew from the stumps of the ancient trees. Do you remember today when we saw yeah. how they grew from the stumps? They were on a stump. The old growth trees were cut down by loggers in 1908. Tutu calls these old stumps the tree bones. See? This is where the loggers cut holes so they can stand and cut off the trees. What do you think about cutting down trees? Kind of sad, huh? Yeah, that's really Because we need trees to live. We do. Sometimes rings of new trees grow from an old stump. See the stump in the middle? And there's trees all around it. These are called fairy rings. And they are, they're called fairy rings. New redwood trees can grow from down trunks of old trees. See how this tree fell down? And there's other trees growing out of it. We saw that today, remember? Redwood trees can also grow from seeds inside their cones. This is what their cone looks like. Can you see from this guy? Oh, were you? Yeah. While the trees are very big, their seeds are very tiny. And very few will grow in the trees. Yeah. The redwood trees can drink water with their roots like other trees. But they can also drink water with their bark and their needles. That's kind of a special thing that redwoods do. Redwoods are evergreens, and Papa likes to use them as Christmas trees. Tutu does not think that redwood trees make good Christmas trees. So she planted a Christmas tree farm. And that's our, those are some of our Christmas trees up on our hill. And one year when you guys all come for Christmas, we'll go cut down a tree. <gasps> Many creatures live in the forest. But only one creature doesn't live anyone else. The banana slugs are indigenous to the Pacific Coast rainforest, which includes the redwood forest. Banana slugs are one of the largest slugs in the world. Do you guys remember seeing banana slugs? Yeah. I know the eye. We're going to have to take you out to and find a banana slug. Yeah. So we have to clean Yeah. And then that, that's a, a newt. A little newt. This is a, this is a big salamander. That's a newt. We are going to take you out tomorrow and we're going to look for these, okay? You haven't seen a salamander yet either? We got to go roll over some logs tomorrow. Banana slugs eat things that are composting on the floor's floor. This includes poop. They eat poop. Isn't that gross? Yeah. Redwood trees have very thick bark. It helps them to withstand fire. See, this tree was burned once and it didn't kill it because its bark is so thick. When a hollow is created in the trunk of a redwood tree, it's called a goose pen. We played in some of those today, didn't we? Yeah. yeah. Goose pens were used by early settlers to keep their livestock safe at night. Newt does not want to go into the goose pen with Papa. He was afraid. Yeah. Newt was scared to go in. You guys weren't scared to go in. You were very brave today. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah no monsters in there. Come explore the Redwood Forest with Tutu and Papa. You guys like exploring our forest? Yeah. Yeah? You should put it Oh. All right. Good day.